Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm going to show you quickly how to find top dead center. I'm going to lay you down here because I'm going to be turning at the crank and I want you visually to see over here. Okay, I'm turning the crank clockwise and I'm going to have my finger over cylinder one to get to top dead center. Now listen and watch. You hear that? You hear that? You hear how it's blowing out the cylinder? Now look. This is spark plug number one in the back. It should line up to right here for top dead center. You want to get the rotor and drop it in. Top dead center to number one. So I'm going to leave it off. And I'm going to go ahead. Hopefully you can see those valves there. Now look, right about there. About right. Okay, let's. That's top dead center right there. That's it. Same place hitting spark plug number. Spark plug number one. You see? Right dead in the center of it. So I'm right there close and I wanted to show you. Now you see? So as always, guys, this pedestal mount, roller rocker adjustment, we're finding top dead center. Now, after you get to this point, you want to mark the crank in four different sections like a pie. Turn it in quarter turns, make adjustment cylinder by cylinder. You start off with number one and you go in the firing order. You can do half a turn or 25 foot pounds. I like doing a half to a full turn, but usually I stay at a half. Thanks, guys.